Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to add a site network to your website and explain how it works. So it's this black bar at the very top of the website and on the left it shows the league logo and abbreviation name and you can click it, it would go to the league website and then there's some teams on the right. Um, now there's two styles to it. Um, there's one where it displays the team logos like this in the bar on the right and there's another style where it just says teams with a drop down arrow and when you click it, it expands down and pops down and shows all the teams. Now, uh, you can choose which style you like. Uh, unless you have over 16 teams, then it's just too many teams and it'll automatically go to this drop down style. So, uh, let's go to the website admin and see how to add it. So, we're in the website admin and then you want to click on design and then you want to click on the site network tab. And this would be set to hide and you want to change it to show and then you can show the site network. Uh, you can also set the color if you want from black to white uh, and then there's the style. The logo bar being this style here showing the logos and the teams menu being this style here. But like I said if you have over if you have too many teams uh, logos to show then it, even if you have logo bar set it'll default to the, the drop down team style. So to set the team uh, the league logo and the team and the league logo name in the stats admin you would want to be on leagues and then click on the league and then this logo right here under the details tab of edit league is the logo that's pulled in for the site network the abbreviation is this right here where it says MASL and the link the hyperlink when you click it is the website link to the league right there then the team websites or the team links so if you don't set the team website when you click on a team logo it'll automatically take you to the team's stats page uh, but you can go to their website if you like so if you want to have it so when you click the team logo uh, it'll go to the team website as well as how to add the team logos is in the stats admin you would be under teams uh, and then you would add your teams and then you would add your team logos so we'll click on a team and then on the details tab you can add a logo right here and a website link so when you put the logo in there and the website link there then on the website it displays the logo and if you click it if you've put in a website link then when you click it it'll go to their website now how the website knows to display which teams and which logo is it uses your active team or active season if you're a league so on the website admin under the main menu there's stats it's a stats right you can click that and the if the site network is enabled it automatically displays the teams for the active team or active season so if your team website will say active team and you set your team here if you're a league website then you'll say uh, active season and so for this example it was pulling from xpl winter and if we refer to our stats setup then we had our XPL League and we had our winter seasons. So that's how it knows to pull these teams for the site network. So that's it. Thanks for watching.